Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Leela Budgets. My name is Kalila. I am a mom of a one-year-old boy and a wife for the last four years. On my own time outside of my IT career, I love to cash stuff, budget, and spend time with family and friends. And so if you want to join me on my financial journey on being debt-free and having financial freedom, click like and subscribe and keep on watching. All right, so let's get going. We'll be cash stuffing $1,135. And I cash counted my cash and it is correct. So let's get going with this. Um, one thing I do want to start out with is a quote. I like to do this here and there, um, sometimes in my videos, but the quote today, uh, which I'm filming on May 14th, it says, you only love once, but if you do it right, once is enough. And I wanted to reflect on this quote. I know that this past Sunday was Mother's Day. You'll probably be seeing this video up next week, so it'll be like two weeks uh, ago that was Mother's Day. However, I still want to say Happy Mother's Day to all the moms, the aunties, the grandmas, um, anyone who um, is like a mother figure um, to someone, uh, to a child. Um, and so... I just wanted to come out here and say this really resonates because, you know, you only get one time to raise a child um, and to raise the child right. And it really depends on what you define as correct or right. But to me, raising a child, you get one chance to make sure that they don't carry generational trauma and that they don't... Um, they grow up to be nice people and to be uh, selfless, to be people who has boundaries. And I mean, they go, um, they'll eventually learn that in life, but to raise children that, you know, do good in the world, that is um, at least my goal as a mother. So happy Mother's Day or late Mother's Day to you all. Um, and then next we'll be going in with my coin jar as usual. I have a good amount of coins here this week. Um, I kind of used some, but sorry, a lot of quarters. And so I plan to, at the end of the year, um, get some money out of this or some cash and use that towards self care. All right. So let's get going um i'm just looking at my budget with me sheet that i did for my previous video if you haven't checked that out check out my budget with me video before this um i will be cash stuffing 1135 which is a little less than my 1326 that i budgeted out but that's because i used some money already for my son and for household items so i will not be cash stuffing that so first off is my wallet binder. I use this or I put this in my bag every single day wherever I go. And so gas will be getting 50. And I think I did this in 20s and 10. So now gas has 50. And how are you guys all doing? I know I have not been posting a lot, but that's because I only get paid two times a week. Um... And I have a one-year-old son, so it's a lot of work. We won't be cash stuffing groceries, household, or kids, but personal has some leftover 
ones has three ones here we'll be putting this to our challenge so i will be putting it to the side here and then personal gets 20 and i believe i just did a 20 for that And personal is used for, like, if I want a coffee, if I'm really tired one day, um, or if I just want anything quick. Pets, um, I left this in our bank account since we'll be... I just started doing, like, online shopping for the food for my dog because it's just much cheaper. It's, like, $5 more off, so I, I just leave this in my bank account. Miscellaneous. Mm has one left so I'll also add that to my challenges envelope and miscellaneous we'll be getting the five and ones and this really is just to pay for whatever um extra that like if I go over on personal I can take it out of this all right so that is it for my personal wallet binder will be going on next to my personal binder and purple is my favorite color as you can tell um and so Kalila will be getting 20 and now I have 220 Here we'll be getting 20 so I think I did it in this 20 also so now self-care has 40 beauty I also budgeted 20 so beauty now has 40 um what was it I was going to um talk about uh, what was that drama that I was watching? Um, I was watching Marry My Husband. I finished that. I talked about that in another video. And then I also talked about the uh, Queen of Tears. And so, yeah, such a good video. If anyone hasn't watched it, not video, drama, K-drama on Netflix. So anyone who hasn't watched it, go out and watch it. Shopping has 30. Uh, but yeah, let me know what other series are you watching on Netflix or Amazon Prime. Those are the two that I have um, that you really enjoy right now. Shopping has 30. Fun will be getting 15. And that is all that we have. I used fun. We went bowling this past weekend uh, for my sister-in-law's birthday. And so that is now empty. But now has 15. Dine Out will be getting 50. Also went out to eat for her birthday, so this is empty also. Alright, Dine Out. And Entertainment will be getting 10. So now it has a 30. And I'm curious, so... What are some things that, uh, as YouTubers, or if you have a YouTube channel, um, what are some things that you had to learn along the way with your journey, right, to hitting like 100 subscribers or 500 subscribers? I just recently hit 100, or now I'm over 100, and I'm feeling the pressure to like create more and more content, but I feel so busy. So what do you do to keep yourself disciplined? guess on making videos um if you have any advice list them below just because it, gets, it can get so busy as a mom of a one-year-old and so how do you balance everything emergency fund will be getting 10 no emergency fund will be getting 145 <laughs> okay So one, 20, 40, five. Hope I did that right. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two. So 8,200, one, oh, 20, 40, 60, 80, 8,200. Oh, 8,300, 
and forty-five. Eight thousand three hundred and forty-five. All right. This envelope is getting to the end of its life. <laughs> the sides are all coming off on this left side, but make it work for now. All right. So that is it for my personal binder. And next will be my family binder. Um, Kais, my son, will be getting 20. And now Kais has 120, 140, 150. The weather has been so nice lately. I um, live um, in the Midwest and so we always just get snow so it's really nice to just you know have nice weather finally and Coda now has 170 Andy will be getting 10 and Andy now has 220 what are some fun things um, that you like to do in the summer with your family. Summer is approaching us and I really am interested and in what um, families who has little children do during the summer. I know there's like the zoo, the park, but like what else? What do you like to do? Um, I need some ideas because I'm trying to do more things with my son this summer. No, parents says 125. So parents had over like 300, but I used like 200 for Mother's Day. Um, and so, yeah, it's down again, trying to get it back up for Father's Day. Date night, we'll be getting 20. My husband and I have not been on a date for a while, so this is um, accumulating up. But now we have 60. I think we might be good for dinner date soon. And like, you know, I mean, date night, it's hard because we have a one-year-old son and, you know, we do things with other people or with my son, but we don't really have one-on-one -on -one time. So I really am going to focus on that, hopefully these next two weeks on getting a date night out there. Um, family will be getting 20. We'll be going to the zoo soon, so saving it for that. Now I have 20, 40, 41, 42, 43 in the family. Birthday, we'll be getting 20. It's my brother's birthday coming up this weekend, so need that. $40 for gifts. I also have a wedding coming up next weekend, so we'll have to save up for that. And that is it for my family binder. And if anyone is wondering, these binders are from Budget with Lena. Um, I got these binders a couple months now. Um, for a couple months now, but yeah, they're so beautiful and they hold so well. So if you're interested, go ahead and uh, message uh, Lena, Budget with Lena on Instagram. I don't know if she's uh, has these still in stock, but it wouldn't hurt to ask. Um, my kids' future will be getting 35. Future now has 2,000, 50, 70, 80, 90, 95, 2,100. Okay. okay, this is not pretty, but. Dream House will be getting 40. And we're thinking five years from now to get our dream house, so it'll take some time, but slowly saving up. 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1,500, 50, 70, 90, 110, 120. So that's 15, so 16, 20. In dream house and 
you know, people were saying that, like, or just a lot of people who have has experience of buying houses, they always tell me that to make sure you get your first started home, don't get your dream home right, um, right away because you'll eventually know what you don't like about it, right? <laughs> and they were so right. Um, so I didn't, you know, I wasn't going to my first starter home looking for a dream house, but I definitely know now what I like and don't like. So 350 in home maintenance. Well, most likely I have to spend this because our washing machine isn't really working well. And so we'll have to get someone to come fix that or else get a new one. So there's that. Um, current maintenance. We'll be getting 25 as usual so now it has 300 in the bank and 25 and for those who don't know i have ally and so i keep uh if you see a prop bill it means that it's money in my ally savings account a uh, high yield savings account a uh, new car will also be getting 25 and so now we have 150, 70, 90, 95, 200. I need to do a cash condensing soon, bill condensing, whatever you call it. Um, I call it cash condensing, but I've seen people say bill condensing um, also. So tech will be getting 30. And now tech has 140. Ever since starting this YouTube channel, I feel like I've been making so much progress on my uh, savings. And so really, thank you for holding me accountable. Um, we'll be adding the $4 to challenges here. This is, this is basically anything that I have left over um, from my personal wallet binder. So I have 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. And we can condense this also. And whenever I hit like 100, I'm planning to put this towards debt. I'm planning to be debt free um, by the end of the year. That is my goal. Um, last binder here is my short-term binder, so anything from one year under. So car tabs will be getting nothing because it is fully funded, I believe. Um, subscriptions will be getting 10. And this is anything like Sam's Club, Amazon, or miscellaneous subscriptions and uh, memberships. 20, 40, 50, 60. Home decor will be getting five and this one is so close I really want to put up pictures of our family in our house so and so I would need this money for frames and for to print out pictures so we have 70 in here and I think that should be enough for like maybe two family photos to put up around the house um, travel will be getting 20 So travel now has 1,000, 1, 2, 1, 250, 270, 290, 310, 320, 1,320. Halloween will be getting $20. I feel so like prepared because I have over $100, so 130 in Halloween. Like this used to never be a thing. I used to cash stuff, but not like with a lot of sinking funds like this. And so this has been a game changer. I've always done like my personal wallet, um, but doing all these sinking funds has been so like crazy good. Um, Thanksgiving will also be getting 20. And now it also has 130. And Christmas, my goal is 1200. And so we're doing $100 a month. So we're doing 100 and Christmas. So now I have 400 and Christmas. And I usually don't take out this 100, but I just decided to for cash condensing purposes and just to have the 100 here in case I needed to take out anything. Other holidays is 20, getting 20, so it now has 60. 
and that is about it for my cash stuffing for today um i have 200 extra this is to give our daycare our um, caregiver and so that is it for my cash stuffing please leave me a comment below how if you enjoyed this video click like subscribe hit the notification bell so you can get more from me i would appreciate it so much i know my next goal is 500 subscribers and so if we can get to that 500 mark i will do a giveaway and so yeah very exciting my channel has grown from just very little to um over 100 so that is a big milestone for me maybe not for you all um, maybe you're surpassed that but for me um i'm just you know a 26 year old mother who wants to um uh, cash stuff so if you like what you see and you enjoy my videos um subscribe and come along with me so if you got this far thank you for watching and as always y'all are the best see y'all next time bye